Hey guys, um, sorry that it's a little bit shaky right now. I'm in the car, I have the camera on the tripod, and yeah. So anyways, I wanted to update you guys. Obviously, you saw that I spent the night in the hospital last night, not for anything for me, but my grandma, who um, I am extremely close with and is more like a mom to me, she went into the hospital yesterday because about three years ago she had a stroke and she said she started to feel the way she felt when she had a stroke before yesterday so um my mom took her my mom took her into the hospital and uh they basically decided to keep her because her blood pressure was so high and um because it seemed like she was having another stroke which obviously isn't good and um ah. And so they wanted to keep her to make sure everything was okay, her observations, all of those things, make sure her blood pressure goes down because obviously her blood pressure was extremely high and she's always been dealing with um, high blood pressure, but it was like on a whole nother level of high yesterday. And um, you know, they just, bad things can happen when your blood pressure is that high. So. They wanted to keep her and I didn't want her to be alone so I stayed in the hospital with her and if she has to stay again tonight I will probably be with her um, I just don't like the thought of her being alone and all of her other kids like um, they all have like their own children and are doing things like you know and she doesn't she doesn't actually really want me to stay there with her, but I don't want her to be alone. She's very much like, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. That's just like her mentality. She's like always fine, even though she's obviously not fine. She's just so strong and just so amazing. But um, I don't want her to be alone. And all of her other kids are like, okay, you know, she says she's fine, so we're going to leave her alone. But I'm like, no, mm -mm, I don't want her to be alone. But anyways, I'm going to her house right now she lives pretty close to the hospital that she's staying at and um, I'm leaving her just for a little bit uh, because I needed to come and take a shower because um, if you don't know if I haven't already said before my grandma lives in Fort Worth um, and I live in Dallas and they're about 45 minutes apart from each other and um, so I'm not gonna drive 45 minutes home uh, to Dallas to take a shower especially if she's gonna be in the hospital like again so I and plus I needed to get her some uh, clean clothes and stuff like that so that's what I'm doing I'm updating you guys uh, I'm gonna get some food also because I'm starving and hospital food is fucking gross so yeah that's pretty much it oh and it's vlogmas Yay! This is the first day of Vlogmas, so I'm gonna vlog every day of December. You, I, I feel like people usually start the day after Thanksgiving and go until Christmas, but I'm gonna go um, from December 1st to December 31st. So, yeah. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, so unfortunately, I A, didn't finish my vlog yesterday and didn't upload it, and B, didn't vlog all day today. I know I'm supposed to be vlogging every day, but it has been a very stressful past few days because of my grandma being in the hospital, and um, Austin and I were both there, like, kind of situating her, and we went grocery shopping for her, and we did, like, a lot of stuff to make sure she's comfortable and okay, because she got to go home, which was really awesome. She got to go home. She did end up having another stroke. We weren't for sure if it was a stroke or not, but she did end up having another stroke, and um, it was just a whole lot of mess and family drama and all kinds of things. And today was Hanukkah and we had just an extremely busy day with me checking on my grandma constantly and having to come here to Dallas to go to Hanukkah. But I'm exhausted and I'm really going to try to do this vlogmas thing. So starting December 3rd, I will be trying much harder to vlog every day. <sighs> I tried my best these first two days, but you know, things happen. So forgive me and I will see you in my next video. Bye.